Hello, Hitless Gaming here, uh, bringing you another Hitless Mentality video. Uh, this video is going to be a purely talking head video. I'm not going to assist it with any gameplay. Um, and it's going to be uh, a video that I hope will make you think a little bit about how you interact and discuss things with people. Um, and this is something that I am also currently struggling with improving in my life. Uh, so it's something that I learned about a year ago and am working really hard to improve upon myself. And I've seen a lot of uh, things getting better in my life with the improvement of the subject. Uh, the subject of today is, uh, it's going to be pretty short, but it is discussing and debating and arguing civilly. Um, it is a very hard thing to do, uh, and it is very hard to... Uh, it, it's very hard to be civil in a discussion when you are the one... Or when you're passionate on the subject. And that is something that I feel like needs to be more... The ability to discuss and debate and argue uh, is something that should be readily... A tool that we have at our disposal in order to develop and grow as human beings and become better people and drive the world forward um so yeah anyways uh there's a couple points that i want to make uh the the first one is uh when you are in a discussion with somebody to keep it civil one of the really important skills uh is to work on listening to what they have to say and then either reflecting that back and showing that you understand to understand their point because their point is just as important as yours in any discussion. So even if I completely disagree with you on a topic, it is very important for me personally to understand your point of view and to understand why you think that way. Uh, and when you decide that uh, during this discussion you are going to start yelling and being angry and being upset and loud and and swearing and anger starts coming through it shuts your your discusser or your uh, I, I think the the debate term is interlocutor uh, it shuts them down and makes them not want to listen to you and so that kind of anger side of it doesn't really work uh, so regardless of how you or how angry you are on the subject or how passionate you are, it's very important to keep kind of calm, listen and understand because uh, you're never going to change somebody's mind unless you understand their uh, unless you understand what their point is and understand why they think the way that they do. And it's really important to kind of get that understanding out of them when you're trying to change somebody's mind or when somebody is trying to communicate a point to you. Uh, it, it, it has a lot of power. Um, and this is why I say to keep it civil in all my discussions, in, in, in my YouTube discussions, on my Discord when we talk about things, and especially recently uh, with the Prospector Pack coming out and that spring a very large discussion in the EVE Online community. Um, i found the ability to understand and listen to people uh, has been very powerful. Um, the other point that I want to make on this is uh, how to discern whether or not something is civil or not. Um, the, the line, the, the place where I place this line, uh, where I decide that I will not engage with somebody anymore, or where I decide that it's just not worth it, to talk to somebody or to continue a discussion um, is when actually we'll, 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 we'll kind of start here. So it is okay. Uh, I'll, I'll just kind of go down the list of like most okay to less okay to we're not having this discussion anymore. We'll walk away and come back to it when we calm down. Uh, so it is okay to attack somebody's um, somebody's idea. Uh, where, you know, I have this idea, well, that idea is dumb or, or bad or, or it doesn't work. Um, it is okay to say that and then it is okay to explain why you think that way. Um, it is okay to attack somebody's thought process uh, if it doesn't work right or if, if, if it doesn't 
if if it doesn't um, kind of actually work. And when when I say attack, uh, I, I feel like I have to clarify the term uh, to challenge or to otherwise uh, say, hey, this doesn't work. Uh, it, an attack would be like if if somebody says, "Hey, well, we'll use a slippery slope argument because it's 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 the one that's been going around." When when somebody says, "If this x leads to y, and if we just keep going on the slope, it'll eventually get to you know the detrimental thing that is like the end of the world," um, that's a slippery slope argument. And I could say, "Well, hey, you know what? Um, that's a slippery slope, and that doesn't work." That is a direct attack on that line of thinking. Um, and that is okay. That doesn't work, and then you need to follow with a because uh, and and an understanding of why that 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 line of thinking isn't logical or that line of thinking doesn't follow reality. Uh, and that is a way to communicate that. And, and I just want to spend... I don't mean, like, physically attack or yell at something. I mean to open up the can of worms and start discussing it uh, is what I mean by an attack. Um, it is okay to attack... Uh, you know, I, I, ideas and thoughts, but it is not okay to attack a person's, somebody personally, um, if that makes sense. So when you're discussing something with somebody, if I call, for, for example, I just had a discussion with Brisk Rubel, and we talked about things. If I called Brisk Rubel an idiot and said, well, you're an idiot, your opinion doesn't matter, that doesn't work. Call somebody an idiot, you you call them dumb, you you... you, you Call them whatever it is you call them. That doesn't work. And when things start to get personal and you you blur that line between personal and logical or, or an idea and a person, like that doesn't work. You can't attack people for the fact that they're people. You can attack ideas and uh, mentality and ways of thinking. And you guys can, and you and your interlocutor can possibly come up to a better understanding or a clearer picture of your reality or a clearer picture of what you actually think or a clearer picture of what they think so that you can understand it better and then move forward in the discussion or the topic so that natural resolution or um resolution or or endpoint can be reached where you guys can walk away from each other um and i i think that is really important uh, especially in today's world, and I am not educated on human psychology. I'm not educated on these things, but I feel it is really important for people to be able to discuss with each other their ideas, thoughts, and mentality so that we can grow and learn together as human beings. It's a very important skill, and it translates to literally everything in life. Your SO, your best friend, your coworkers, uh, any kind of debate politically, uh, learning how to play a game, like this literally translates not just in the EVE Online world, not just in gaming, but this translates into everything. And being able to discuss and have a civil, rational conversation with somebody is incredibly important. Um, yeah, that's really what I want to say with this video. I I don't know how to put it clearer. Um feel free to discuss, feel free to talk to people and please, please keep things civil. Uh, we have enough hatred in this world. We have enough anger in this world. We have enough of the bad. We need to bring more good and we do have a lot of good, but good comes from civil discussion and people get invigorated when people calmly discuss their problems and when people calmly engage in these subjects. Um, and I, I mean this about literally everything. Um, but that is a part of my mentality, uh, that has been going forward and I haven't made a hateless mentality video in something like five months. And this is the one today, just yesterday or today, I felt really inspired to make this video because it's one that I've been meaning to make and one that I feel is very important to the hateless mentality feel. Um, if you like this video. Uh, make sure you like and comment and subscribe and make sure to include, uh, if you feel comfortable, of course, a story where listening and understanding has brought you better results than getting angry. Uh, because the more we get in the comments about positive interactions that you've had with people and also even possibly a negative interaction because you got angry, um, 
the more we can learn and grow together and continue bringing each other up. And as always, make sure you guys fly fun. Enjoy your time gaming, having fun, and interacting with each other. And I will see you guys in the next one. Uh, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe below. And fly fun in EVE Online.